Hey everyone, this is Squall Snake, editor in chief of MyGamer.com, and today I'm playing Flight Path Adventures in Venaris. I guess that's how you say that. This is the first time I'm playing this. Don't really know too much about it. We're gonna jump right in, and some type of a shooting game is pretty much all I know. And let's say we play as Kath the Engineer because she popped up first. MyGamer.com, SquallSneak.com, and at ZagGaz if you need anything. Z A C K G A Z. This is Beacon City. Who's this guy? He's got some sweet shades. He's got a weird crest on his nicely sewn shirt. I'm sorry, we're already closed. Feel free to come by first thing tomorrow morn. That's quite all right, ma'am. Insurance fee. I'm really sorry we have any customers sick. I just don't have the cash. Oh, snap. It's not my problem. Now I hand over the cash. I don't want to spend an extra second in here. Man, what a jerk. Please stop. I'll have the money next week, I promise. Next week? Are you kidding me? I can't wait that long. Uh-oh. There we go. Path to the rescue. I think we're good on insurance today. You have no idea who you're dealing with, Missy. Oh man, let's go home. Oh, I said get out. Smack. Who's this other guy? There's two of them? You'll regret this. All right then, let's clean up. And get on our plane and go shoot stuff. When are we gonna shoot stuff? This is all my fault, should have paid them. However, those two think they've learned their lesson. It's not far from here. Did you mention something about a ship? It's old, but it still flies. You can have it if you need it, thanks. I'll take good care of it. How does she have a flower shop and a spaceship? Could you go make some money with that spaceship? Like if I had a spaceship, I'm sure you could make a lot of cash with that. Here we go. Mission start. Episode 1, The Junkyard. Okay, let's see. Goes pretty much standard. We're gonna move around. Yeah, I got that. L using the left analog stick. Okay, here's a switch for the shields. Oh, we got shields going on up here. And looks like we got some shots over here. And if I'm correct, this fires the machine gun. Dang. Looks like we have unlimited shots. I wonder what this does, though. Secondary weapon. There's a secondary weapon. Whoa, that's going to be handy later on. Or handy right now. So it looks like it, that's on a cooldown timer. Oh, goody, a booster. Good, I think I got this. Okay, this thing is reloading up here. Comms ready. You're trespassing into the junk car schemes, private property. Turn around. I'm sorry, I don't think I... This thing has a reverse gear. That's not funny. No, this is funny. Knock, knock. Oh man, we're gonna go mess these guys up in their junkyard. Why would they need money from a flower girl if they're living in a junkyard? Oh, what's the star? Taking some damage. Ready. 
They really got to use the secondary weapon a lot because the... Seems like the normal A button shot is a little weak. I mean, it takes quite a few hits to take down these basic planes. And all this stuff in the environment kind of gets in the way. Yeah, the other buttons don't do anything. It's just A and B, at least so far. But, I mean, if it feels good. Oh, here's a shop. Feels smooth, accurate. Hello there. My name is Micah, and I'm your friendly shop vendor. Since you're new here, let me give you a little tour. This option's disabled for now. Let's take a look at some weapons. Currently, we're running a special pro promotion. All... New visitors get a pair of laser beams for free. Heck yeah, I want laser beams for free. Okay, so yeah, there's supposed to be some kind of an extensive weapon system. Oh look, it seems like your ship is equipped with an old generator. It doesn't have enough juice to power both your lasers and the machine guns at the same time. Let's take a look at the generator catalog. Here you have the selection of jennies that can attach to your ship. Let's go ahead and get one that can power both. That's pretty interesting. The little generator that could. So keep that in mind before making big purchases. Let's go back to the top menu. Secondary weapons surround your special attack. Get the one that best fits your combat style. Armor defines how much damage you can take after you lose your shield. If you like bumping into stuff, it might be worth the investment. Shields are in charge of absorbing damage. The better the shield, the more better it absorbs. Uh, that concludes the tour. Feel free to check around. So that's pretty cool. So I got full. I can't repair anything because I'm full primary weaponry, secondary, and generators. I probably can't buy anything, but let's see if I can get a, uh, maybe a side. Let's just see what's detached weapon from ship. Your standard. I got 300 points. Energy cost one. You know what? Let's buy this machine gun. Why not? Installing this weapon will drain more energy than your gener- Oh, so let's just hold off for now. So it almost seems like you gotta maybe even get a generator first. Alright, let's just- Yeah, we'll just exit the shop then. We got a- We got a laser. We got a- Oh yeah, there we go. I was just saying, like, it seems like we're a little underpowered, but probably- Yeah, there you go. We can just cut through this now. Yeah, much better. If you want to dismiss in that rust bucket, there are easier ways to do that. This rust bucket just took down half your security. Shoot that thing down. So yeah, there was an option in the menu where when you get those cutscenes, you can choose to slow down the action, which is what happens, which is pretty cool. So it's just kind of weird to have so much story for a shooter game. Usually that doesn't happen. Yeah, it feels good. It's a very well-controlling shooter. This is going to be a boss, I'm guessing. Oh, look at this. There we 
we go. Got an achievement. 60 points. Please recycle. Defeat the Junkyard King. Boom. Mission cleared. Got another achievement. Pesky Meddler. 60 points. Destroy 100 Syndicate enemy ships in a single session. And I better not see any of your lackeys hanging around Beacon City ever again. You got that? Cough. Like that would make any difference. What do you mean? I'm just a middleman. In order to burn your place down, came from above. From who? The chairman. I don't know who he is. What can you tell me? I don't know. Better gear. Take those. Might be able to smoke them out. Keep talking. Level two. Oh, and just before I get the places swarming with security. If it's anything like your security, I'll be fine. I don't know what that green arrow is in the middle of the screen. It's been there. I'm taking a lot of damage here. It's like you can't kill. Yeah, you can't gotta bet. You can't kill every enemy that you see. Let's see what happens when you die. Holy cheese, your ship, ship is in really bad shape. We're probably worse than this. You get a loner ship. Look at this side quest. Micah's bodyguard. That's kind of cool. So yeah, I think you were pretty much supposed to die. Hello there. Why don't you head a heater to the loner? So that that's kind of cool. That's something a little different. You know your ship is going down. I guess you survived the plane crash that you died. Let's take this loner ship, which is actually better than the your ship. Why don't we just use this? Forget about the regular ship. Give me this loner. This thing's more powerful. It's got these crazy heat-seeking missiles. Things that shoot off to the side and in front of you. This is way better. Yeah, let me just get this ship. You can keep the other junk ship. Oh, my ship blew up. That's cr that's crap. Like, you can't... Like, get out of the way, dude. Why are you standing right in the middle? Oh, man. So it's almost better to just save up like, why would you get the solid titanium arbor when you can just get this for like 500 bucks more? Like, you're better off just saving and get the best thing all at once. Same thing with the generator again. So there's like... Oh, generate. Okay, I understand now. It's generator usage. Yeah, so it's good to just like, so I got 2,500 bucks. 
shields, how many shields is... Well, maybe I can get the best shield then. Top of the line provides fast recharge and a large... Yeah, maybe I just get this. There, so I got... So there's no... So, like, I don't have to buy any more shields now. Like, that should be fine. Already installed. Okay. So let's try that again now that I could take a couple more hits, but... We'll see how that goes. Yes, you really, uh, you really got to get all the gold that you can. Every dollar counts. Jeez, there's a lot of bullets. I'll repair and then we'll just keep going because I can't really buy anything. I want to save up for a better gun and a generator now that I got a good nice shield. Offensive is going to be important. You should see a split up ahead. If you want to take some upgrades, take the right. You should be able to spot them fairly easily. If you want to destroy weapons cache, take down the left. Lot of enemies. Got them all. Okay, survive that time. Got another achievement. Uh, 60 points to Syndicate Threat Destroy. 500 Syndicate enemy ships in a single session. Why not keep them? I try. They're incompatible with the ship or any ship. What do you mean? Look here. See these connection ports? These are all standard. I'm going to quit to the main menu, episode 3, the old hub. 
but yeah, I just wanted to demonstrate some of the gameplay. I I like this shooter. I mean, there's a lot of there's a lot of story. I like the upgrade system so far, and again, it's just kind of a nice solid controlling shooter. So yeah, this is Flight Plan Flight Path Adventures in Venaris. Check me out at squallsync.com and mygamer.com and on Twitter at Zach Gaz, Z-A-C-K-G-A-Z. And until next time, thank you for watching and game on.